Hey guys, let's turn this around. Hello everybody, it's Mr. G. We are going to talk about environmental art today. So I'm going on a little hike, a little walk through the wooded area up on top of a hill, not too far away from my neighborhood. And we're gonna to try to find some things out in nature that we can make art with. There's a really cool artist named Andy Goldsworthy. And if you want to check out some of his stuff, you can go on YouTube or you can just Google Andy Goldsworthy. G-O-L-D-S-W-O-R-T-H-Y. And Andy Goldsworthy is a famous environmental artist who goes into where he uh, lives. He goes into the woods or basically he travels all over the world and he finds cool things in nature and he makes art out of them. Looks like somebody was building a fort in here. Maybe my kids when they were little. This, this is a place that we used to hang out when we were, when we lived closer to here. Some cool rocks, we can build something with rocks. Andy Goldsworthy builds a lot of his art using rocks and sticks and things like that. So I'm gonna go try to find some nice rocks and I know where there's outcropping at the top of the hill here. And we'll see if we can put together some cool art. What he does, Andy Goldsworthy, is he makes art and then he photographs it really, really nicely with a really beautiful camera. And he keeps all of his photographs and he sells them um, for his art. He makes really cool books out of his art. So here's a nice, this used to be a rock wall, I think, or when they cleared a field for this farm here, they put all these rocks here. So I'm gonna see if I can prop this camera down here and maybe build something right about here. See if we can do that. I like that. So it's starting to rain. Yesterday was a beautiful day for this. I should have done this yesterday. Yesterday was 70 degrees for April 7th in Wisconsin. That is a really nice day. So I'm gonna use this rock here and I'm just gonna start stacking rocks. And hopefully I can do this quick because it's starting to rain even more. It wasn't raining when I first started this. So we're gonna put, a, that's a pretty rock. Put that on top. Is it this one? That's got some green moss on it, so it's kind of colorful. It looks like it's stacked pretty nice. I'm trying to go from biggest to smallest and build kind of like a pyramid or something that looks like a snowman. This one's got some pink in it. It's also got some moss or is it lichen? Leechen? That's one of those words that I've never really known. I think it's lichen. L-I-C-H-E-N. All right, now this is a really pretty one too. It's going to be a little bit more difficult to stack these because it's getting a little wobbly on top. Let's see if I can get one more. I might not be able to get this one on there. I don't think so. Perfect. Well, should I press my luck and try to get another one? Maybe one more. Well, this one's really, really round. That's a cool rock. I doubt if I can get this on there. No, that's not going to work. Oh boy, I pressed my luck. Now they're not going to want to stay at all. Now I got to redo this. That one's on. See if I can put this in. Oh, 
Okay, perfect. So, let's see if we can get a good picture of this. All right. So I did a good job of stacking that. And I think if I were to take a picture of this, I'd probably want to come from this side, maybe get a little lower. That looks really cool, just like that. You can see the sky in the background. It's got uh, negative space and positive space. The sculpture itself is the positive space, and the negative space is the air and the sky all around it. That makes for a pretty cool little piece of art. I'm going to leave that there so that when people come hiking down this path, they can see the creativity and the art here and they can appreciate it so thanks again guys for listening this is environmental art and go look up andy goldsworthy there's a really great three minute it's only two minute and 59 seconds video called who is andy goldsworthy and it shows you some of the art that he's created there's also other videos that have an hour an hour and a half worth of andy goldsworthy so if you really love that three minute one, you can learn more as well. Bye guys, have a great day.